Hey, 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 greetings and welcome to another video. Today we're playing Civilization 6, so let's have some fun. But if you close Hello awesome people, welcome back to Civilization 6 and welcome back to my journey playthrough. Last episode we set up some more science for our hopefully soon to be scientific victory. Uh, we actually got rocketry so we're now, we have the spaceport available so if we build it in the city we can actually make sure that we can do some space projects and launch them. Um, but that's still far, far away uh, ahead of us uh, because we still have to find out these projects uh, first. Let's continue on, let's see, uh, there's also some other options, we could also go and attack uh, Saladin if we want to, we could go for Poland, um, which might be an option, um, and India is still a threat, although we seem to outpace them at this, at this point, we stole the Blazing World from France, awesome, so let's go for Zanzibar, let's take that one as our suzerain, well we will, we will be their suzerain, um, we have a trade route available, where should we go? We have any city states that want a trade route. Palenque wants a trade route. Sure, why not? Let's send you over there. Um, you are gonna sabotage production here. Uh, we're just gonna try and um, sabotage all of our opponents. France is not really an important opponent for us right now, but we can do some stuff over there, and we couldn't in any in, in other civs. So. Let's uh, build the last aluminium line in, uh, mine in our lands. Is it a mine or is it a quarry? I don't know, actually. I think it should be a mine, right? Yeah, I think it's a mine. Do you have some more resources to improve? We still have the horses to improve, but I'm not sure if that's still worth it. We have the niter where we grew, where we grew to with bone zone. Might be an option. India is still in our lands because we have open borders with them. And we stole some more money. 65 gold. That's very good because we level up. Uh, we leveled up our spy once again. Um, our spec second spy, that is. Uh, you are gonna... Are you gonna need better walls? I don't know. Oh, we have the uh, great engineer from last episode who could... Potentially give us uh, what? What did, what did he give, give us? A factory in a workshop and factories provide plus two production uh, through the whole country. So let's do that one. It's a very good one. And let's uh, that actually shaved off three turns from our walls. But I think it's better to go for um, another pr another uh, district here. So we have science, we have uh, industry. What should we go for next? I think we should go for. Um, the spaceport is way too much, but I think we we should go for uh, amenities are very good, so we don't need that. An encampment really we don't really need that. A commercial hub might be good or a feeder square. You know what? I'm gonna go for a feeder square, and then we're gonna place a commercial hub up in here. No, actually, the commercial hub gives good bonuses to the Hansa. So let's do that. Let's go over here. With the commercial hub. Uh, you. Oh, you could actually steal something. It's very good, because you have the scientist uh, pr uh, promotion, which gives us uh, steel technology as if two levels more experience, which is very good. Counter spy, we don't need that. Disrupt rocketry as if two levels more. Siphon funds, let's do that one. It will be a lot easier to gain levels if we want to. Uh, oh, they actually settled the city up here. Wow. Talking about a forward settle, they're, they're over here. <laughs> Poland is still here, though. I think we didn't fought a war. Yeah, we fought one war with Poland right at the start because there they wanted to sell this area. There are extremely hard. Steel, a diamond, and to know oneself. So we unlocked steel. The which effect would of give the mass oil. media is not to elicit belief, but to maintain the apparatus of addiction. Well, we could already see oil because of our great scientist, uh, one of our great scientists. So, what should we go for now? I think we should go for computers. Although, let's check it out because I'm not sh totally sure where we should go. Let's go for nuclear fission actually first. Um, because if we get that, we can hopefully get some nukes to defend us if we need to. And then we're gonna go beeline for these projects. For the actual victory. That's gonna be the plan. Um, 
Let's go ideology, so we can get our new governments in. Ah, uh, you, Humphreed. What are you called? Humphreed? Whoops. Okay, never mind. Uh, trader first. <laughs> uh, let's go to... Let's go to Nidavos. Why not? Let's just uh, set up some routes with other people too. You... Uh, no tech boost to steal. Okay. Can we steal a tech boost somewhere else? No, wait. We could just do this and get another easy mission and another easy upgrade. And then we can use you. Because level 3 is the highest level you can get as a spy, I think. So... At least my other spy is level 3 and he's not leveling up anymore. So let's see what this turn is going to bring us. So Clash Struggle. Um, ideology against another spy. We can do another, we could do another spy. I don't think we need that. So you are going to prepare for ourselves for the victory. You're going to build a spaceport. And that spaceport is going to be like over here. Probably right next to the encampment. So we can easily defend it if we need to. Um, you could go for a spaceport. It's 30 turns, yeah, but it's probably still a very good idea to do that. Um, yeah, you're gonna build it here inland between the mountains so we can also defend it if we need to. I think that's a very good idea to invest in that right now. You want the raven for iron and some gold. No, sorry, that's not what's gonna happen. Uh, you want a defensive pact. I, I like the defensive pact, but no. I'm gonna see if we can um, figure out something else for that deal. I'm gonna come back to that though. I like a defensive pact with someone. And the Aztecs... Why are the Aztecs wanting a defensive pact? They're over here, they're pretty much isolated. They don't really... Don't really seem to have a lot of that going for that, but still. Okay, so success, sabotage production. Uh, but the Aztecs are not really bordering someone. The only one that's close is Saladin, but Saladin is not really a threat. But what we well, we still are gonna do this. We're, we're gonna try and get the defensive pact in. Let's see. I've never had a defensive pact on my series before, I think. Six gold for defensive pact, sure. Way better than the last one. Because I don't want to ch uh, exchange my works. So, um... France. Can we sign a defensive pact with you? No. India, do you want a defensive pact? No. I think the defensive pact is part of a, a, a cultural civic, and um, since the Aztecs are way up ahead in that, they have that option. Um, can't do anything else anymore here, so let's go somewhere else. Let's go to the Aztecs? <laughs> no. Uh, let's go to... Ooh, we might want to go to... No, actually, we might want to go to something like uh, Delhi. But there's no tech boost to steal, so why would we do that? Cairo, no tech boost to steal. Why do they show up if they don't? If they can't do that? So let's go to Baghdad then. Um, it should be production, but we can't do anything there. Why are these icons popping up if we can't do that? Let's go to... Well, in that case, we should go to the Aztecs. And hopefully they don't, uh, they don't find out. You're gonna go to Cairo course let's set up some more trade routes with the uh, capitals of other people and there's still something to say for going after uh Jeddah and uh, and probably back that and you know get this island under control what are you guys doing are you fighting hmm, doesn't seem like it but can we upgrade you I don't think so, no. I think we should bring the U-boats back. And start working on something else. So, you're gonna build a U-boat. No, I want you to build a... Ironclad, actually. But we don't have enough coal. The other thing we could do is just uh, build a... Um... Let's set you over here for now. And let's... Build, uh, try and buy a infantry or something like that. Yeah, an infantry. That's gonna be good. And the infantry is gonna take the city if we want to, because I'm thinking it's time for at least taking out Saladin, maybe. 
um, to gain some extra cities up there and try to get a... This is a very safe island, actually. It's a very defensible island, too. Um, so where are we? We are building in Sweet Tooth. That's over here. So what are you going to build, Sweet Tooth? You have some good production going on. Do we want to wander out of you? Maybe the Eiffel Tower? That's not a very good one for us, though. Forbidden City... Wildcard policy slot and extra five culture. That's actually pretty darn good. You know what? Let's gonna let's try and build that. It has an open spot over here. Let's just try it. Let's see if we can do that. Uh, let's gain sources here. Let's move on. I'm still quite disappointed that we don't have anything really of useful resources in this area. Maybe we have your, some uranium there. That's I think the last option. We don't have oil, we don't have aluminium there, we don't have uh, niter there, we don't have... Uh, what's the other one? No iron. Normally the desert has that kind of stuff. I have always considered that the substitution of the internal combustion engine for the horse marked a very gloomy milestone in the progress of mankind. Slowly, ideas lead to ideology. Lead to policies that lead to actions. So we got ideology, that means we can now open up... Um, these guys and i want to go for democracy since we don't really need uh, the extra military policies and we do get a military policy for free as germany so let's go for democracy so the infantry is going to move out the infantry is going to move up here you're going to go back and defend the city the u-boat is going to come back we're going to try and go to Jeddah. And the idea being is that our infantry will go on land somewhere over here to defend itself. And then we probably shoot the city until we have uh, it down enough to get it with the infantry. And because we're scientifically scientifically so advanced to, on the other civs, we could easily take down the city probably. Um, since we're just way stronger with our U-boat fleet. We filled in siphoning funds. It was a 90% chance that we would do that. So Jetta seems to not ha really have a lot of stuff here. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring in the infantry over here in the jungle. Which is very defen defensible. And we're going to wait until the city is low enough so that we can actually take it. Uh, we, again, we're going to siphon funds. You need to do this because we need the last upgrade on, on, uh, on you. So... Oh, we need to renew some friendships. That too. So... Okay, do we want to be friends with Gandhi? I guess we do want to be friends. But no alliance. We want to be friends with France. Yeah, clap your way, uh, way around that. So, let's uh, see. We want an alliance too. Why do you keep clapping? Accept the deal. You gonna clap again? Yeah. Clap, 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 clap. Okay, so <laughs> let's move on. Um, Jeddah might be a good opportunity here. Let's go to land and let's see. Okay, this is a very open stuff. We can easily defend this part, by the way. Um, I think next turn we can actually go to war with them. Because it doesn't seem that they have... They still use catapults and stuff like that. They, they haven't really upgraded their army. Because they're very... They're doing very religious stuff. What's this? This is a caravel, so it can't shoot us, which is very good. Although it wouldn't do much damage, but still. I want to minimize the damage. They have a settler going out. We could take that settler. This is not a... Um, this is a seat, all right. It's coast. Yeah, so our U-boat should be able to go here. Um... The idea being is that we need to declare war first, probably. Um, let's let's check the rest first. So, you're you are a spy. You're gonna try and get a great work out out of the Aztecs. Um, should we do this? Yeah, we're we're gonna do this. So we're gonna make a deal. Um, no, never mind. Denounce. No, I wanna. We don't have any. Reasons to go to war. Normally you could do a, a, 
Oh, declar declaration of war because of something. So a Casus Belli, yeah, that, that's what I meant. <coughs> but we don't have a Casus Belli on these guys apparently, so let's just declare a war. A surprise war. I know that's very bad. We need some action in this series, so let's do this. Blood never sleeps. That's totally fine. And India doesn't like us now. But we still have the friendship agreement with them, so it doesn't really matter because they can't attack us right now. Oh, we're gonna take out the settler, which is very good. We're gonna bring you back. The settler is just gonna be. We're gonna see if we can bring it back so safely. Hopefully, we can. And we can settle up some, some, somewhere over here. So let's just bring you back. Hopefully, you will reach uh, our lands. Probably not, but that doesn't matter. Just harassing them is, uh, is good enough. You, are you still out there? You're still out there. Uh, you're gonna move back a little bit because you you, you aren't gonna go and fight the uh, swordman. You got you're gonna suicide yourself if you do that. So. How about the city states? Okay, so Bandar Brunei is taken over. We are still the suzerain of a lot of, a lot of other ones, so I feel that Better that's to fight that's for something than live for nothing. Do we have uranium Men, somewhere? Their rights and nothing more. Women, their rights and nothing less. Okay, let's uh, let's go for democracy right now. So democracy is up. Um, this is still good. Uh, we need to go for let's let's do hmm, let's do plus one gold from all the envoys so we get a lot of gold so we can buy units if we want to. Uh, still the great engineer, great scientist. That's that's totally fine with me. Science, gold, and culture. That I think that's that would be pretty good. Um, let's go for the. Hmm. I don't think we really, really have very good ones to go for right now. So let's go for Cold War. Just got to get up space race. Okay, well that that could be useful. Uh, the girl's best friend. You are just sitting here. Uh, great library can still be built. Um. Hmm. What you're gonna do is you're gonna build another market, I guess. Just get some extra money in the bank. Um, we're gonna see if we can purchase a battleship. No, we can't really purchase that, so. Uh, we are gonna build a lighthouse. Uh, ooh, we, have, we are standing on some uranium. That's the other thing I needed to do. I needed to check for uranium. So you just keep uh, looking around. We have the U-boat. The U-boat got shot by something. Oh, it got attacked by the caravel, okay. But do we have some uranium nearby? We do have it over here. So we need to buy that tile be before someone else gets it. So 200, that's the uranium we want. Um, we're gonna kill this guy. And what we're gonna do, because that, that guy could also take our settler. Um, do we have some more uranium close by? Not really. We're gonna buy a builder over here to improve that uranium. There's not a lot of uranium in our vicinity, so... Well, we at least have one. That's enough. That's enough. We're gonna attack. Major victory. Yeah, we're gonna attack because we will just stand here in the in the jungle. Be very defensible. Um, where should we go? Do we want a uh, city-state? No, not really. They don't have um, missions for it, so let's go to Delhi. Let's go to Delhi. And continue on. So we're at war with Saladin. Hopefully we can take down the city quite fast. I think we should be able to do that. With our U-boats. Oh, people are shooting at. Is it the Mamluks? I don't know. Are the Mamluks ranged units? I can't remember. I don't think so, right? We can't really see right now. 
So let's see, uh, just do some damage. And then we're just gonna heal up over there. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna move in and you're gonna shoot the city. Oh wow. Oh wow, I didn't expect that. Okay, we can do a lot of damage. <laughs> Uh, we can do a lot, a lot of damage. Uh, another spaceport? No, not needed. A workshop could be very good, though. Um, we're gonna send a trade route from here to... You know what? Just go to Gdansk. It's totally fine. Um, you, a builder. You're gonna go to the uranium. Improve the uranium. And then we get the option to get uh, nukes. You know what? I don't need you anymore. Uh, I'm just gonna... Here. Here you go. Go away. That will save us like one gold per turn. I, not, not, not even, I think. Even less at this point. But they will be fine. We will totally be fine without a scout. <laughs> we don't need the scout anymore. We, all, we almost have the entire map, so... So what is Saladin doing? Is he attacking my infantry? No, he's uh, retreating. So that's actually very good because we need to heal up that infantry. So we actually managed to steal some more, some more gold. You are definitely going to get a promotion. Um, a girl's best friend, you're going to build a power plant. No, let's go for research. Uh, the U-boat. You could actually be very useful if we could do this. Uh, you, uranium mine. Oh, now people are gonna w need to watch out, especially India. Uh, so you can level up. Cab worker, steel, steel great works. And you have a really high chance of escape. That could also be very good. No, let's go for cab burglar. We could use, uh, we could use it because we could steal some great works. I think that would be a good option for us right now. Probably after this war, when this friendship ends with Gandhi, they are going to denounce me. And they are sabotaging my production, which is not really cool to do from them. Okay, we have some Inquisitors. We oh, okay, we have a crossbow over there in Cairo, which is totally fine. He can shoot us. It's just XP. Uh, okay, he found out about our spies, so sorry. Um... Try to turn on foot and failure. So, hmm. Okay, where are you? You are over there. Um, okay, we, we still have to shoot the city first, so. Let's take down the city to quite low, actually. We're gonna bring in this guy over here. So next turn we can take the city. Uh, we have the uranium mine. What should we improve? What should we go and improve? Maybe we should build a farm over here because this, uh, this city is dying. And uh, we have our spy over here. You're gonna move because you you can detect. You have technologist and cat burglar. And what's the other one? Con artist. Okay, so you can you can do a lot of things really well. Uh, let's go to Paris. We can steal a great work there. So let's go over there. You should be able to do that. And um, this city is gonna be ours definitely. But that's gonna be for the next episode. Well, that's it for today. Feel free to comment and leave a like if you've enjoyed the video. Also subscribe if you haven't and check out my Twitter and Facebook pages. The links are down in the description. It really helps me out a lot when you guys do that. If you want to support me, then please check out my Patreon page. It's also down there. You can get some cool rewards for helping me out, like sneak peeks and a vote in future projects. As always, I've been Hipbone, you've been yourself, thanks for being awesome. Thanks for watching.